So this build here is a max movement speed build, highlighting on Julie, ultimate escape with this modification here. So make sure to utilize it. Also stamina reduction, slippery for more movement speed. We have more movement speed from the actual ability to fight and flight. If we go to close encounter, this will give us 10% less, uh, more movement speed and reduce the stamina consumption by 10% for five seconds as well. And then we have choose flight, which will refresh our charge on our own stamina bar once it depletes to go back to full K ability to give more movement speed. It's kind of nutty. And the endurance being at level 50 and toughness at 34. So plus nine, plus 20 with this skill tree right here. Should make sure to utilize it and have some fun with it. It seems to be a great build. And I can't wait to jump into the action with this build. So let's get into it. Max movement speed, Julie. Let's enjoy it. Let's enjoy it. It's super fast and it feels great using this character. Enjoyable time. Enjoyable time. So let's get running. Slam into this. We need a bone shard for a close counter build. It's a prox by using a bone shard. So get one of these right here. And while you do follow us on Twitch and the new subscribers on YouTube. Welcome, welcome. We stream Texas Chainsaw Massacre every day. And it's absolute insanity here. Love to see this sport. So let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. So keep running here. We're going to try and survive. Then we're going to slow down our stamina consumption because we don't want to reset our bar. We want that to still be applicable once we're in a chase. So our one charge on choose flight will activate then. You can get that thing to three charges and three uh, refreshes on your stamina bar in a row, by the way. There's no cooldown on them. It's actually insane. So you can run the whole map. Like you're part of the Olympics. We'll go over here. Now, every time we get out of a crawl space, we also get max boom speed. We reach 5% more. So we got 5, 10, and it gets pretty crazy just doing stuff in general. Everyone's over here. Okay, interesting. No one's got a locked door. I better get on myself. Should be around here. Actually, I don't think it's around here. Hey, Sunny. I hear him. It's here. We may have an issue. Yeah, he seems to be very close. Sunny on your right, Sunny. Watch out on your right. I'd give him a call out because I feel like I can hear him. Because usually what ends up happening, the claustrophobia of the screen going yellow with a yellow hue, that's supposed to annoy you and not tell you where the sense of direction is. If you listen to the sound of the chainsaw revving and echoing through certain locations, you know. I just realized there's two different sprints. What the hell? There's two different sprints in the game. Okay, we'll talk about this after. I feel like there's something no one, nobody knows. Oh, you son of a gun! You son of a gun! Look what you did to me! You hurt me! Pressy, 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 pressy! Come on, come on! Yes! Yes! I got you, man! I got you! Crawl space, increase move speed. Jump me! Try, try! I win this! Yeah, yeah I thought so. You can't beat me. I'm out. So without door, he's thrusting behind us. I hear someone else here. Oh no! Did he see me? Do you think he saw me? The son of a gun saw me. I'm safe though. I'm safe. Oh my god, the max boom speed is clutching it in every situation. Okay, I can outrun him. I can outrun him. I think naturally too. Don't go there! Hitchhiker's there! He wants me. This guy wants me. Is he tripping out? He's so tripping out. He's like, what? Where did the guy go? He's invisible. This guy's a hacker or something. That's what he's thinking right now. I've been chilling here the whole time. Well done. We escape. That movement gave me the gap I needed to hopefully cut the sight line as well. So that was really nice on our part. Is he right next to the chicken? Might die here. Did 
Did he hear it? Did he hear it? He saw it! He saw it! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Close encounter. We gotta win this. We gotta win this. Why not? Now we get increased movement speed by 10%. Which is quite nice. Sadly, it doesn't actually work the whole time. I'm safe. I gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. What door's that? What door's that? What's open? I lost my charge and choose your flight. I had to use it. I had to use it. Okay, it's alright. I had to use the charge. I was gonna die there. Go through here. The dragon's right there. I saw him. Yep. We have been a bit of an issue with our medical supplies here, but should be able to make this work. I think we're pretty safe. Having good movement speed will help us greatly here. We got more pots. Someone just died. On the close encounter. I think close encounter. Yeah, we get a burn scrap. We need it. But now we can be much more comfortable after using our charge to escape that close encounter. That's why Shoes Flight is very, very good for those situations. It resets your stamina, gives you the gap you need to pretty much get away from the killer or the family in every situation. So make sure to utilize it. It will help you greatly in your matches. And also, Julie's base proficiency is pretty dirty as well, as you can see. Looks up pretty nice. Let's get it with me. Don't really care about grab as much. I just need to find the door that's open. Is there the one next to that area? That has a lock on it still. Is there the ladder in the kitchen? It is in the ladder in the kitchen. It isn't the one here. One, two, three. It's the one there? It's the one there. I feel like someone's on the other side. Please don't. That's really bad. Connie's over there in the other gap. I can see her. I think I detected you. If not, I'm going to make some movements over here. And I'm going to go upstairs, actually. Where it's safest for me at this current time. Fuse is not here. Look at that move speed. It's insanely good. I mean, moving around the map like it's nothing with this build. Fuse box is here. We got the fuse. Nice. Well done. I think that pop in the pot because I need the HP. Use this one here. It's more. Nice work. Can you not do maths? Like, how long is he going to take the fuse? Just do the maths, please. It's like two plus two equals four. Just do it, please. <laughs> Why is it taking so long? You can't do it? You can't count? Oh my god, dude. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, that guy's hilarious. He teabagged. <laughs> I want to save him, actually. That was good. Look at that movie speed. I dodged it like it was nothing. He couldn't do the counting. Right away. I did it before he did. I did it in three seconds. I did it in th No, what are you doing? You're dead. He's dead. <laughs> he got himself killed. The panic he's having. I did that in three seconds. Three or four seconds. That's insane. Now, with my movement, I have two choices. I can jump down the well. Usually, that's maybe the better option, just to quickly reset. But in a case like this, I'm just acting my ability and just run the whole way down because I can. Look, I can run the whole way like it's nothing. How good is that? How good is that? I'm doing crazy movement right now. And look, I'm running next to exit. Simple as that. 
Max move speed, Julie, is intense. It is so good for your victories. You move around the map like a bird. It's actually insane. You're light as a feather, and it's so good. It is so good. This guy might die. Oh my god, one HP! No! No! One HP! Recover, recover, quick! Move it closes! The door's gonna close. You lost. The door's gonna close. No! 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 <laughs> oh god. That hurts. That hurts. Oh, she nearly had it. She nearly had it. That is crazy. What a match. What an absolute match. But this build here, choose your flight, slippery and fight, and fight. Fight and fight is very interesting build to actually utilize for just constant movement. Every time you go through a crawl space, 5% movement. When you're in a close engagement, you get movement when you escape it. And then when you need to actually escape multiple killers, use your choose your fight charge. If you have one or three charges, depending on the level, will help out. And your ultimate escape ability just works with all this at the same time once you have it active. It is insanely good. It helps with all your matches. Make sure to use this build if you're having hard times winning or getting away from killers. This is maybe your option. Use this movement speed build on Julie. Have a lot of fun with it.